rain's coming again. <laughs> About this top. Wonderful. Wonderful. Relax. So is it top three in your age group that's gonna get that you're gonna get a spot in or what? <laughs> so haven't had a chance to film, was planning on filming this whole thing, this whole half Iron Man. I like Iron Man 70.3. It doesn't uh, people think half, it's like, wow, you're only doing half, and it's like <laughs> half is a long way. Yes. Yeah. I would call it success, right? Yes, it was. Yeah. We each got our medals. We all got medals and <clears throat> shirts. He got a backpack. I didn't know there was a backpack. <laughs> now I'm upset, but my wife's happy because I got plenty of backpacks. So we're going to actually start our vacation now since I got no footage except for Todd at the at the race, the beginning of the race, said, telling us we're fucked. I think that was the, the verbiage. And, uh, and it, it was. It was all fucked. The, the water was 61 degrees, freezing. Then you get out, up into the 90s, climbing 3,000, 30, 3,300 feet. There was an extra 300 yes. feet in there. And then um, running 1,200 feet uphill for 13 miles. <coughs> yeah, it was a vomit day. I didn't vomit, but I saw a lot of people vomiting. I saw people keel over and need paramedics. Yeah. 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 We saw one guy freak out because he had a cramp. I mean, and one guy died in the water. Just so you guys know. On a happier note. <laughs> yeah. Um. Just so I'm just basically I'm rationalizing why I sucked in the water. At least I didn't die. <laughs> That's many, the baseline. <laughs> as many, many people thought I died when they were tracking me and they said last seen swimming. They thought I died basically. Okay. Yeah. I, we, we were looking for the milk containers to have a picture of Todd on hell. Thankfully, I saw Kenny on the run. Uh -oh. He was only about seven miles ahead of me, which is a lot. Uh -oh. And I said, I am alive. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So we all made and it. And the look on his face was like, okay, but I'm going to die. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Oh, it's still going. It's, um, yeah, what's up, Mia? Can I say something? Yeah, you gotta speak up though to get the okay. microphone. So mom was like, wow, we haven't, the tracker last seen Todd at like, <laughs> like six whatever in the morning. <laughs> Let's wait until, you know, like two to go down there. Wait, no. <laughs> no. I was the only one that was concerned. I wanted to go down there at like 9 a.m. make sure everything was yeah. okay. These two were like, eh. Jack, were you concerned? Not really. Because <laughs> Jack knows I'm a survivor. Yeah. I've done worse. We've all done worse. But yesterday was, you know, it was close to the bottom. It was a rough race. No, yesterday was the, was definitely, I, in my opinion, between the marathons and the hikes and the Rainier bikes and everything like that, yesterday was truly one, one if not the most hardest thing I've done. What yeah. about, like, the one marathon you did that the Space Center? Oh, the Space Coast? Yeah. Oh, that was my very first marathon where I... Oh, ended you didn't up, train? I didn't train too much, and I ended up walking from mile 15 on. So I'm used uh, to being in the back of the pack. I actually enjoy it back there. Yeah. We are kind of, we have a little camaraderie. <laughs> it was like, I'm used to the death march. <laughs> it's like a death march, you know, and you, you kind of oh. like, yeah, yeah, you know. It... If you picture like an apocalypse and like the survivors trying to make it to the next town or something, that's what back of the packers do. So I'm yeah. used to it. You see, I would think it would be more synonymous with like um, a retirement community of old Jewish people just complaining. <laughs> oh, there was an old guy that definitely was, you know, Ooh. you know, everybody checking the watches to see if they're going to make the cutoff time. But I assure you, since I was one of the last people, 
uh, to cross the line before the cutoff time, there was probably about three, four hundred people that didn't make it. Yeah. That didn't survive, and, and my, my heart goes out to them. Yes. Because we were all part of it. A little part of that misery. But I'll tell you what, there were a lot of, you know, people f fighting back there. You know? Yeah. Well, good for them. Yep. Yep, and cross the lines. Turn the fucking car on. It's fucking Dude, I forget. Oh, Jesus Christ. And, but now I've got this other noise, and now it screws up the video. Oh, I'm sorry. Anyway, we're going to get going. We're going to Bryce Canyon. You're going to join us. Heading on up this guy. This this room wrong, this one is wrong. It's not wrong. That's four. It, no, the four. Oh, it's you, a one with a V. It's a one with uh, a V. Yes. Uh, so this is a, a. Yeah, they got that one right. They understood. They understood this, but they don't understand this. Okay, I'm just gonna say it. Balled off. I don't like that name at all. I do not like balled off at all. Ah. Yeah, balled off established Actually, 1864. Actually, there are some clocks that are known to have that four. What? Yes. Yeah. So let me show you. I don't know. I like this. Look. And actually, some of them do. Some of them don't. That one. That one does. That one doesn't. Well, some of those clocks are wrong. Look. That one. Look. See. Why no? Why would you do that? Because the angle, you may have confusion with an IV and a VI. They might confuse it for a six or something like that. Okay, well, I six don't. Is fine. One V might look at differently for somebody. <laughs> so you're saying it's for uh, the visually yeah, oriented look, uh, disabled? Look, that, that's a little confusing right there for people. See that? No, it's not. It's that's that. No screams of four this one what's that an n n o'clock see it's iv anyone and yeah but look you see this looks like an n and that looks like an n so it's kind of but the problem is okay so here's the problem is when you're using those eyes you're supposed to make them okay, out look, like this real is eyes. a roman numeral in oh. like a, a an established thing in paris Oh, Why you, do clocks and watches? You're really gonna. We're gonna look, really set the standards look, with. Look, there's actually a Google on it. Why do clocks and watches use Roman numeral I don't one, like two, three, where four this instead going. of IV? I do not like this learn guy. I'm hoping I guess because they proved me wrong. Wait, but where, why do the French have anything to do with what? clocks? It's a German what? thing. What? How did the Germans do it? Fuck the Germans. But they're the clock.